East Coast always in me Commonwealth milk junk Getting love from my city yeah. I roll call for the DMV In my own lane You could still ride with me Who yeah. knows I made mistakes You won't end but it's too late I don't need your support Just to know I'm important I won't ever sell myself short Cause I know you'll see me on the come up what's going on my name is alicia welcome back to our channel if you are watching for the first time definitely welcome i hope you guys decide to stick around like comment subscribe share the video if you care if you like these kind of videos now you can go through and you can watch all my other videos if you would like to catch up i will have another grocery haul coming for you guys tomorrow with vegetables fruits and etc because i gotta go to sam's and get that but today we concentrated just on meats and what we needed to get so we went to Claiborne Hill no we went to Rouse's we went to Rouse's Claiborne Hills and ran in a Walmart just to pick up a few items and tomorrow like I said we have to go back to Rouse's Sam's and a few other stores so you guys just stay tuned and like I said like comment subscribe and share if you care so we're gonna go ahead on and jump into this from Rouse's we went on and got this is what we're going to have for today. So we got two different packs of steaks. These are the beef. Well, no, they the same, right there? Yeah, yeah they the same thin, steaks. Thin. One is just thin sliced um, and one is not. These was $13.49 for three and these was $20.53 for another three. And like I said, we did share all of the prices in the walkthrough. So y'all make sure y'all watch that. And that is on my main channel, Alicia Southern Crew. I shared a lot over there. We got the Swaggerty Form Sausage and Biscuits for my little one for breakfast in the morning. From Claiborne Hills, we found these chickens. And these was, what, $9.99? $9.99. And it's a five-pound bag. So we went on and got three. And we looked out because these are the smaller pieces. They're not those huge chickens that look like they've been, you know, soaking in steroids. So it's a good bit of them in here. So we got three of them and when we go back tomorrow we may or may not get one of two more it all depends on what we decide and then from rouse's we was gonna get their ground beef it was what nine and ten dollars for the same size pack but we just decided to go ahead on and get these from um <laughs> yeah <laughs> that's my nephew y'all we just decided to just go ahead on and get them from claiborne hills because it was five um, five ninety five, six twenty eight, six forty three, six thirty seven, and six seventy one. So we got five packs. So we ended up saving what we said twenty dollars. Which if we would have got these from Claiborne, we saved twenty. We if spent fifty at Claiborne, then we would have spent close to forty at Walmart. At Walmart, right? So we ended up saving um, a lot. So we got those, and then we got one pack of leg quarters. We may get another pack when we go tomorrow just to have them in our freezer. And these was, I think, $5.49 or something like that. But like I said, if y'all want the exact prices, they're at, in my walkthrough. Then we got the bone and lamb chops. If y'all been watching the video, Jordan been saying he wanted some lamb. And I think these was $14, $14.99 or something like that. And then from Claiborne Hills, I did get my crawfish boudin. I wanted the boudin ball. Mitch, you know it's hard to find boudin balls right now. Rouse's didn't have them. Claiborne Hills didn't have them. And normally those two stores specialize in them. They always keep them. So I just went on and got the, um, the regular boudin sausage. And this is the crawfish. And if you've seen in that Claiborne portion, they have the shrimp boudin as well. But I wanted to get the crawfish boudin. So I'm probably just going to put those in the air fryer or either in the grill part of my oven. I got Mama Beef Liver. And they come for a pack, of course. Now we're going to jump over here. Um, we did get how many potatoes? Six. Huh? We got six potatoes, and they're all really big. These came from Claiborne, and like I said, if y'all interested in seeing those prices, check out the um, walkthrough, because y'all will see how much we pay for these. From Walmart, I got three packs of cookie dough. I get the great value, because in my opinion, they taste better than the Pillsbury, and they are cheaper. 
I got the Boathouse, the Berry Boost, and the Breakfast Smoothie. I'm going to have this one in the morning before we go back out shopping. I've been wanting to try their kombucha. So I got the Cativa one. Um, this is the Pineapple Peach. And then I got the Synergy one, the Raw Kombucha, the Gava Goddess. And I want to try that one as well. We got four of the Calypsos. I'm going to go to Winn-Dixie tomorrow and get their Calypsos because they're cheaper at Claiborne. How much was these? Do you remember? $149, $159 something like that. 149 or something. $179. For the Southern Peach Lemonade and the Strawberry Lemonade. But I know Winn-Dixie normally have them cheaper. Sometimes Walmart have them, sometimes they don't. And I forgot to look today. The one in our city normally carry them, so I'm going to see. And whichever one is cheaper, that's where I'm going to get them from. We got one thing of cheese to go on our baked potato today. And then two things of these little... Jigali? Cotton candy. I couldn't think of the name. I got two cotton candies for the little one. I got Mama one thing of eggnog. I drink eggnog, but she drink it more, so I just only got one for her today just in case she wanted one. I got a thing of salsa from Walmart to go with some chips. I got this gum for my little one. He put in his book bag. Jordan picked up one of these. And then we got a thing of sour cream for the potato. I found me a carrot cake. They had their bigger carrot cakes at Claiborne, but they was like $49. $39. And they was huge. But I just got this little small one. Got two things of butter for right now. Mama wanted some lemon cake for today. So I got her one lemon. And then I got the iced vanilla. Onion powder. Walmart was sold out of onion powder. They only had three of these big ones left. Y'all remember last month they were sold out of the garlic powder. And I had to get one of these big ones. So, And I got one thing of Turkey Hill lemonade from Claiborne Hills. Three things of the Great Value Juice, two Berry Punch, and one Tropical Punch. One thing of whole milk, like I said, until I go back shopping. At Claiborne, they're, they have they, um, brand drinks for how much? You remember? $250 or... So I got my more root beer for now because she, want she wanted the bottle root beer and Cokes, but I'm going to get them from Sam's. You can get it, little Miss. Go ahead. So I got um, just one of these for her now. And then like I said, when I go to Sam's, I'm going to get the bottom ones for uh, one strawberry, a Sprite for Philip, and a root beer for the house. My zebra roll, my zebra cake roll, and my zebra cakes. <laughs> my uh, mission, I love these missions. And sometimes Walmart have them, sometimes they don't. So I grabbed them, and these came from Rouse's. Yeah, Rouse's. Rouse's. Sometimes Claiborne Hills be having these in stock. But like I said, with Walmart, it's always a hit and miss. We got some barbecue pork rinds. That's for today for the game. And then these chips are for, um, not just for the little one, but he asked for side cream and onion chips. And that's it. Believe it or not, that's all we got for today. And all of this stuff was less than $300. So that's really not bad, especially for all these meats. And then uh, tomorrow, like I said, I got to go back to Claiborne Hills and to Sam's. So um, if y'all are interested in seeing that bigger haul tomorrow from Sam's and all the other stores, I'll stay tuned. So we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. <laughs>